Hello there, welcome to this drawing and uh, we start drawing using the line tool and press F5 then draw a line of uh, 105 and in this direction 60 and we draw a vertical line extending a distance of 25 now copy this line from here up to here and this one and this one from here up to here okay now we copy again this line from here up to here Now we draw a line extending a distance of 30 as you see here and we copy this line from here up to here and also we copy this one. Okay. Now we draw another line or we just directly go to isocircle and start drawing a circle here but before that press F5 and the radius is as you see here it's 15 the diameter so the radius is 7.5 7.5 Now we draw another line extending a distance of 45 and 60 in this direction and close it. Okay, now we draw this line from here up to here and we trim this line and also these lines. Okay. Now we draw another line extending a distance of 30 and we sorry we draw this line and we move this line from the midpoint to the midpoint of this line. Now we draw another line from here up to here and also one from here up to here. Now trim press space again uh, uh, twice and delete this one then trim and trim this one okay now no need for this one now copy everything here from this point a distance in this direction uh, of 20. Now draw a line and copy from this point now trim and delete this one and also this one now we draw another line from here up to here okay now from the midpoint of this line we draw a line of 25 and we have a line of 30 30 we move it from this point up to this point sorry from the midpoint up to the end point and we draw a vertical line 
press F5 and draw a distance of 30 and from here we draw another isocircle of uh, radius 15 and one of radius 7.5 so press F5 and draw 15 and another one of 7.5 copy this horizontal line from here to the center and trim select this one and uh, trim select this one and trim the lower part and now we draw a vertical line from here up to here and copy this line from this point to this point okay now we have an arc here this arc is of uh, has a radius of 8 so we draw a line from here going up a distance of 8 units and in this direction 8 and now we draw a circle isocircle from here up to this point okay now we trim but before that we copy this line from here up to here now we trim We do the same steps for the other direction. We have uh, we draw a line of eight, and in this direction eight, and we go to isocircle. And from here we draw a circle. Now we trim this one, and we trim this one. Okay. Now we copy everything C O A short for copy a distance of 18 press F5 and write 18 and now we draw a line of starting from here to the quadrant this at this point uh, sorry Z. There is a mistake in the copying process. We draw a line of 18 and we copy just the outer frame, this one for example. Okay, and we copy. Uh, from this point up to this point now we draw a line from the quadrant to the quadrant and now it's time for trimming We clean everything inside, trim, and uh, for these details, we draw a line of 30. We just copy this one because it's 30, not this one draw a line of 30 and we move it from here up to the midpoint and we draw as we see here we have a vertical line of 14 
so we press F5 and write 14 and we copy this line from this endpoint uh, midpoint to this midpoint at this time we don't know the length uh, how much is the length of this line but we can find that so let's start drawing a horizontal line uh, that have a distance of 30 this one for example press tab uh, at first and specify the angle at 180 then tab again minus 30 this is the line and uh, we have a line at uh, 60 degrees and from the side it should be 112 so we draw a line and press tab 112 uh, 120 and that's it and from the other side this angle is 60 so we draw another line and from here press tab 60 and that's it now we draw another line which is the small segment of 14 sorry 14 okay now we draw another line uh, no just uh, yes we draw a horizontal line 180 for example up to this point and now move this one from here up to here now it's a matter of trimming finally find the distance from here up to here it's uh, it's 46 so we draw a line of 46 and copy this line from here up to here and draw another line of 30 and move it from here up to here now just write L and start drawing from here up to here and from the other side as well this is it and now trim and delete this one trim again and that's it now draw another line which is the last line and press F5 now trim and that's it this is the end of this video thanks for watching bye